All right, now I'm going to be doing a review on the movie Jumanji that I saw today it was instant on Netflix, and I decided to watch it. Now, uh, Jumanji, it's about this board game uh, that was uh, made uh, a long time ago, years ago, and it's uh, been recently discovered by this uh, kid who plays it. He got sucked into the board, and, you know, he's, uh, like, uh, gone for so many years later, then, uh, you know, he's uh, rescued. And, you know, all this stuff happens, like chaos, and uh, a lot of stuff, like, it has a lot of action with uh, monkeys uh, and a lot of other wild animals, uh, and it's, uh, to me, I think it's a really fun movie to watch. I really enjoyed this movie a lot. Now, this movie, it came out, like, in the 90s, uh, and uh, the CGI, you know, like, uh, the part where they got sucked in the board, I thought it was uh, pretty decent, you know, like, um, it wasn't too bad, but the parts that I thought were kind of outdated were the parts where you see the monkeys. Now, that I thought looked kind of fake, and really not that great, but, you know, it wasn't, like, terrible. Like, I knew when, when there was CGI, it was uh, kind of noticeable, but I liked uh, the storyline to this movie. It's really fun and entertaining to watch, uh, more of like a younger kids type of movie. I don't think this movie would really appeal to adults that much. Uh, I don't really think uh, adults would really care for this movie that much. I think it's more like a younger kids thing, uh, not really like Disney movies like Finding Nemo. But I uh, personally enjoyed this movie, uh, you know, like, uh, I wasn't really bored throughout this movie. I was actually pretty entertained. I th was expecting to be entertained, uh, and, you know, like I was. It's uh, quite a fun movie uh, to watch. And I would say it's uh, kind of worth watching a second time. I wouldn't really say it's worth buying on Blu-ray, like I didn't buy it on Blu-ray because it was instant on Netflix, uh, because I watched uh, it off Netflix from the TV, and I think that was about worth it. It's a good movie. I would show it to some of my friends. I'd say it's probably worth doing that, you know, like, uh, because uh, some people might, you know, enjoy this movie. Now, uh, I would recommend it, and, uh, you know, like, for probably, if you don't have Netflix, then I would say it's probably, you know, like, worth a rental. Maybe not really worth buying. Maybe I would buy it on DVD. I'd say it's worth it. But, yeah, anyways, uh, I'll probably rate this movie a good, strong 3.5 out of 5 stars, 7 out of 10 stars. You know, so I think that's about a good, fair rating. So, you know, you can comment down below what you think of this movie if you've seen it. And, uh, or if you're thinking of seeing it, if you have uh, questions about this movie. But yeah, I don't really want to see the ending because I don't want to spoil it. But, you know, it has a good ending to it. Like, it doesn't leave off like uh, as a sad ending or anything. Yeah, I think the ending is good. But anyways, yeah, I guess that's the rating. Three and a half out of five stars, a seven out of ten stars. So that's it. Bye.